Hello guys, welcome to K1 Repair Center. I want to show you how to open the Dell XPS 27 uh, or 27, which one is it? You give two different names. XPS 2720 touch all-in-one desktop or call XPS 27. Just to show you how to open it, when you want to change the hard drive or you want to upgrade the RAM, you have just a customer, bring it here, we have upgrade to the one terabyte SSD. This is what we recommend at the moment. Um, if you want to keep your computer, we upgrade to SSD for reasonable price. However, um, let's go on and start to do it. Turn it, turn it and put it flat and the flat surface with the screen down. Careful you not put something underneath, be sure is everything is all right. So now you got two screws down there. One, the Phillips screws or plus screws. One this side, you open it. You don't, the screws is not normally not coming out. It's just hanging inside. I'm going to show you in a second. You see this is, That's it. This is stay in and you got one the other side. Alright, then you open two screws. It's actually easy. You don't need to open anything else, okay? Just so don't confuse yourself. Little bit slot it down the space there. So now what you want to do is put two hands here or there on the bottom there. Actually you put a uh, perfection with that's it. Have you saw that it's just a slotted? Let me do it again. You see? It's a sliding, that's it. It slot up. So you slide it that one out and that is come that's it voila i need to say voila. open it um here it shows the picture it stays your hard drive underneath here it's not it's nothing to do with the hard drive you can open that one to change to upgrade your ram if you need it your hard drive you see it actually is underneath this part yeah you want to open that one as well you can open that one as well if in case you want to look inside but if you want to just upgrade the ram open that the screws your ram underneath here you can upgrade it you got or you can open your other screws here to take it a plate off but if you want to just to upgrade your hard drive change your hard drive this underneath the leg and you got a six screws fill it the screws so you open now you lift that one up lift up and you slide it at the front there you see this is the lip go underneath there so and this is the uh, honestly we have upgrade that one already if you put one terabyte in there um just want to show you how yeah if you upgrade uh, ssd you need to have a caddy special caddy yeah otherwise it doesn't fit in there because they're big yeah you see this is they are normally come with a three and a half inch sata drive in there and you need to get it the um Kelly a case for the SSD to upgrade it. So that's it actually. It's very forward, it's very easy to do it. Now put back together honestly what I say. You need to put the lip there down there and sit it nicely down. Oh one second, let it open, open again. Just be careful when you put it there, when you put your new in there, just to be sure the cable has got enough movement. You don't want to tie it too big tight to damage the cable, yeah? So, put back in. Once again. Put the screws inside. I don't suggest you should tie it up for beginning. Just to put some in there that holds it and, um, and end. Tie everything back. Couple more screws. So it's open again. Hmm. International. So now we're going to tighten up. You don't want to really keep tight it too much. That one. That one. One and two. So now you take your back plate again. 
and put it in the right position. Uh, push it down and then slide it. That's it. There you go. It's in. Okay. You don't want to really force it because it's it's very easy and four boots go in there. Uh, on two screws you got to hold it up and just a check on the corners. It's not hanging out or it's not bent or anything. And um, actually that's it. That's just what just need to be done. So now when you take it out and you put that again, what I say, go check corners. Is not hanging out or is pushing it. It's sit nicely in there. That's it. You don't need to open any other screws. You have few screws in the back there, and you don't need to open them. You got on the leg screws here underneath there. Again, you don't need to open. Mostly, most of them is like that. Two screws on the bottom, open and slide it off. Uh, that's it. Right now, we are going to turn it on. Yeah, I'm going to upgrade the. Um, don't have this side, the other side. We are going to upgrade the software now to Windows 10 Pro. If you have any question or anything that you want to know about it, um, how to upgrade in or something like that, um, just drop me a comment. I'll try my best to answer your question. Uh, enjoy the day and see you later. Thank you for watching K1 Repair Center.